hello guys welcome to this tutorial by Zeno trust um, so um, we discovered that Facebook removed the option that enabled people to add a call to action button to their page post and um, I decided to do this tutorial to show you an alternative way or another way of doing you know that so um, this is how it goes um, in the previous tutorial I did mention that the um, link to go to is facebook.com slash ads slash manager. So all you need to do right now is to go to that same link, facebook.com slash ads slash manager, and open it in your browser. Okay, so having done that, you will see um, a page that looks like this. Okay, so um, next, come over to ads manager at the top left. Okay, click on it and head over to page posts and then click on that okay now having come to page post next click on create post okay so um, in the previous tutorial um, there was an option here that you know enabled you to add a call to action button but that does not apply anymore right now okay so um, let me see doesn't <clears throat> so it doesn't apply anymore because they've changed they, you know they made some changes to um, the system so but what you want to do right now is come over to carousel and click on carousel okay okay so what you do now is impute the um, name of your website so let's just say my website is Zeno Trust. Okay, let's come. That's ng. Good. Okay, let me just um, write something and say best best IT company. Okay. All right. So um, I'm just gonna stick with learn more. All right. Okay, then um, next I'm just going to say, um, let me add an image. So I'm going to add an image directly from my image library. Okay, which one should I add? Okay, let me just use this. I'm, I'm going to use this. Okay. So um, this is the image um, I'm going to use for this particular um, post. So let's just say headline. Let me just ask a question. Do you need IT services? Okay. Okay. Let's just say get the best of software development. Yeah. yeah okay destination URL now this is where when they click on learn more um, this is where you want them to land so I'm just going to go with HTTPS okay slash Zenotrust Zenotrust.com.ng okay so um in your case it might be selected that only use this post for an ad but what i want you to do is i want you to um, click on use this post for an ad to be published to the page later okay and um, well you might as well select a language i'm just going to go with english and united states okay let's just go with united kingdom okay so I'm going to cl click on create post. So let's just go through to make sure that everything is good. Um, yeah. yeah, everything looks great. So I'm just going to click on create post. Hmm. Uh, okay, there was a problem with the URL I entered xenotrust.com.ng okay yeah I forgot to put my two forward slashes 
so I've done that so let us English and Nigeria what am I typing Nigeria where you are okay so I'm going to click on create post and now everything should be fine okay now the post has been created but at this point it doesn't just show up on your page what you need to do next is to click on this um, checkbox here at the left hand side of the post click on it and come over here um, to actions click on it will be a drop down next click on publish okay so I'm just gonna publish this post right now okay so the post has been published yeah um okay let's see the post let's go to our page um i'm just going to refresh this page and you would find out that the post we just created would be there hopefully okay so um this is the post we just created here um you know everything we need you need it services best it company get the best of software development okay so if i click on learn more now you see that it redirects to my website okay so um yeah facebook kind um when you create a post using the carousel methods they grab pictures from your website and you know display it so that's why this is a picture on my website let me let me show you this picture over here right yeah it's on my website so they grab this picture from my website and you know they just displayed it here so but it doesn't actually affect your post if you click on the learn more it still takes you to your website so here it still brings us to my website so there is actually um no disadvantage there okay um so basically that's it that this this is another way you can quickly create um, a free Facebook post, you know, that has a call to action button that, you know, leads people to your website. And after creating the post, of course, you can quickly just share your post and, you know, either you share it, you know, to your Facebook wall or you share to another page or whatever you want to do. Okay. And if you feel like you want to boost the post, that option is very much available. Um, you, all you just need to do is click on boost. Um, your post and you're good to go thank you very much for watching this tutorial um, if you're not subscribed to my channel you should do that immediately because I make relevant tutorials for you um, at request so thank you so much